Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel and today I've been contemplating life itself really. I'm 43 years old, going on 44 this week. I've got this really bad haircut at the moment, I don't know what's going on, I decided to have it cut a while ago. Now I kind of look like some, I don't know, some castaway from Wizard of Oz or something. Um, I've also got quite a bit of spots at 43, um, come on. 43 years old, should have had this when I was 16. I'm a spotty bastard. Anyway, so I've been contemplating about life, what my friends have been doing, because I seem to be having a lot of children and getting married at the moment, and I don't have either. And also, all the problems going on in the world, like the Ebola virus that's over in Africa, seems to be spreading, and just general shit day-to-day -day life so I was kind of thinking what can I do to improve my life and maybe a few others so I've decided to review the new Star Wars Rebel sticker book from Panini let's check it out right so here is the new Star Wars Rebels Panini sticker book and I just picked this up recently I saw it in the shop and thought fuck it why not and I used to collect sticker books years ago. I had the Transformers, G.I. Joe, Thundercats, Action Force, Mask and I threw them away like a lot of people did and now they get quite a bit of money so don't throw them away or if you do put them on eBay and sell them and get some money. So this is to coincide with a new uh, Star Wars Rebels cartoon that's just come on TV and it's a follow on from the Clone Wars cartoon. I've not seen any of this series yet but I've seen the trailer on YouTube and it's very good. I'm quite a big Star Wars fan, I'm quite selective on what I buy with Star Wars stuff because there's just too much stuff there and I don't have the room. So, yep, yeah, this is the book and a couple of packs of stickers. I've put some more in there, I'll show you in a minute. Stickers were 50p each and they're a right pain in the ass to find. I've only found one shop that sells them so far, so I've gone in there a couple of times and picked some up. And I bet the cashiers thought, what a fucking loser he is. It is age buying this sort of thing but I don't care I'm a geek so they can fuck off so let's have a look at the book so here's the book and noticed inside if you first 250 people to send away 15 empty packs of stickers you can get a free Stormtrooper poster and some badges so I thought fuck it why not and I've done it the other day so here's the uh, book first page is blank it's a uh, run-of-the-mill stickers if you've collected them over the years um, I'm not sure if it's me but the paper feels thinner I don't know if it's me just reminiscing of my old days where the paper was nicer but I'm, I'm sure it wasn't but yeah uh, I've got a few in there so far I've bought about 15 packs so it's just got character bios I haven't got a clue who these lot are because I've not seen any of it. And there we go. Pictures of TIE Fires tells you the story. I've not actually read the story because I don't want to give the story away when I watch the cartoon. And as most sticker books, you get uh, foil cards. This one doesn't have that many, but I've had about three or four so far, so it's not too bad. So yeah, just go through it quickly. Green skin lady, I would. And then we come to the poster that's always in the middle. And slight improvement on this one. I remember getting the books and used to get the hologram cards that were in the poster, but they just do normal stickers on this. And the problem they did, they always put a sticker in the middle of the poster so when you folded it it ruined the sticker so you had to pull the poster out or put the sticker onto the side so I think it's the first time I've seen this in a sticker book but they've done it and the rest of the pages got the classic Star Destroyer Stormtroopers other guys Mandalorian sexy ladies more Stormtroopers Jedi's and smiling Wookiees there. The new droid chopper, who I think it's meant to 
be R2D2 sort of replacement. No one replaces R2D2. More stormtroopers and the ghost ship apparently. Jedi. And there we go. And you can also send off for the I think it's the last 25 stickers when you get to the end of your collection. So say if you're getting hundreds of swaps that I never knew two years ago. And that's how I used to complete my sticker books. So that's the sticker book. And the stickers. Which are these? Let's open a pack up. I've sent my I've sent my empty packs off for my hopefully to get my poster through. There's the stickers there, one pack. Let's open the other pack up. And what I do, because I'm quite OCD, when I finish the sticker book, I always buy one pack and I stick it in the inside of the book that's unopened, so there's always one unopened sticker pack to look back on years later. And that's how gay I am. I am. So what I like to do, I like to sort them out into the hundreds and the below hundreds. And there's the poster ones. And then I put them in order and then I go through the book. So I do it that way. So I do it like that. 77. 75. 51, 78, lots of 170s, 151, 119, so when I go through the book I start from beginning to end and I've got them all in number order, that's, that's how OCD I am, I'm not really that bad but it's just, just sort of like a, a thing I've always done, so stickers, there we go, I know I've got that one, and you get five per pack, there we are, there's the postery one, which is a bit of a shame. I should have done specials. I've one there, and I've got that one. Jedi, Ghost Ship. I think I've got that one. And then that, that one, and that one. So there we go. I'll stick those in in a minute. So that's it. The Star Wars sticker Rebels book. And if you're a fan of sticker books, I keep on saying about sticker books is quite annoying now. If you're a fan of sticker books, pick this one up. It's just come out and it's quite good. I like it. I'm going to add it to my collection and I thought I'd do something different from this video. So hope you enjoyed it and I will see you soon for some more reviews of other stuff I have. Bye bye.